Hello everybody and welcome back to Echoes of the Plum Grove where today I'm gonna go and check oh well, actually we need to get some stuff for our uh, drying racks first don't we and she lab needs a bit of a nom we would like to just double check watering though okay the watering can seem okay at the moment let's get some Root off the trees, and I'll need to fish. And let's go collect eggs and make sure that everybody's all okay. So we let a load of eggs rot. I was I was super busy just getting stuff for, up together. I'm really hoping this episode we get the stuff from my house. I am really upset that it's taking this long. So we now have everything we need except for, check, I think except for, we need to get some more stone, we need to get two more pieces of glass, so I'm looking for sand and stone, we have the nails, we have the iron bars and we have the wood and then we're looking for the five paint, we also need to have 1600 in the bank and I don't think we're going to quite have that, so you're looking quite fluffy today. Let me shear you today. Looks like every two days I get to shear the sheep. I don't know what's going on with the cow though. This is where I find like I'm milking with the wrong... Let me just see if the same thing happens if I click on the on the sheep. Hang on. Yeah. I wonder if the cow needs a different kind of bucket or something. it says a bucket not a pail maybe the pail is for goats let me just check that milking cow Let's see because of the plum grove gosh we can't even do it and i keep writing grave as well Echoes of the plum cow. Oh, apparently there used to be male and female ones. Let me just check that this this isn't somehow a male cow or something. But I I don't think. Oh, you're a youngster still. That's why you're not an adult. Oh, there's no point in milking you then. So there's a calf, there's calf young adult, I'm guessing. Ah, uh, okay, that's fine. I can wait for you to grow up. You're about halfway through. Not a problem at all. These are all growing nicely. And I've also got a whole load of um, turnip seeds that I could be planting as well, which might be a useful thing. Let's stick in another row. I like my garden this year. I can stick in another row of peas behind as well if I need to. I just keep, need to keep them nice and far apart. Spend a bit of time as well on the... Oh yeah, I've got my gold to hand in today as well, haven't I? I'll do that in a minute. I'm sure we had turnip seeds. I don't know what those are. There's something that grows in spring, okay, clearly. That let me plant them, but I had 41 turnips here. I would like to grow some of them into nice turnips and then I can have I can sell them en masse. I made so much more money when I was able to sell crops. And being able to not have to buy the seeds is great as well. Apparently, um, Pineapples and pineapple seeds and things like that. I think they might be the pirates as well. Just waiting for the pirates for everything, aren't we? They are the, the keeper of the keys for all of it. So I'm going to need to collect more sand and more stone today. Like I said earlier. Uh-huh. As I'm planting these in, here comes Penelope to water them. Perfect. 
That's, it, that's why it's probably a good idea if you have a farm helper to plant things in in the daytime. If you do it last thing at night, you've got to water them. <laughs> if you don't, then your farm hand will, will water them for you. And it's wonderful. Okay. Looking good. Got our farm. We've got all of our trees. The trees are... Oh, the apple trees are done. Finally. Yes. So in the autumn, we will have apples. Uh, whatever these guys are, we'll have those. Maybe they might be summer ones, actually. I think these might be spring ones. I can't remember what that one is. That's the same as that one. So I think they might be like peaches or oranges or some something along those lines. Not sure. Put those away. Anything else I need to put away? Not really. I can sell like my eggs and wool and stuff. I'm not ready to make a loom quite yet. Happy enough just to keep collecting the animal products. Right then, so let's head into town. I, say, I don't know why this, the sailors didn't come to see us on, on the last couple of Saturdays of winter. I wonder whether the seas are too rough. Or something like that or whether they only come at the beginning or, or what the deal is i'm not sure i'm almost certain that everything in my icebox is rotting away right now <laughs> i'm just here being obsessed but i will go and hand in my gold today i will try and get sand and rock apricots in return 11 days to get them i have apricot tree so i can start saving them up oh no hang on that wasn't the one it's six mackerel a common small fish found in fresh water that is for an iron fence blueprint i could try i can try so we'll try and fish for the mackerel today then fresh water Don't know what that would mean. Let's go and hand the gold in anyway. I'm going to have a look at all the pillars in general. To see how the game thinks we're doing. Because I think we've finished quite a lot of it. The game might not think so. So what I'm thinking is that I, there's a lot of crafting that I need to actually just make. So that it adds into my book. And then if any of it comes out gold star, it needs to then be donated. But I'm not in too much of a rush to do that because I know that I will have... I'll be able to do it. I've got all of the recipes I need. I just need to make the thing. And it's just going to be a case of collecting lots of iron and collecting lots of wood and stuff like that. So that's nothing that I can't do. Uh, whereas collecting recipes and, and things like that, even making the friends isn't that hard. You just have to choose a couple of people and just give them lots of gifts. But the thing that I think is difficult is getting like the recipes in the first place and getting the um, blueprints in the first place. But I feel like I'm in a place where I could probably make quite a lot more stuff. For example, I could probably get another four things just from making the candy maker. Which I now have the pine sap for because I bought it. So, Even though I don't have a tree tap. There's nothing requiring me to make all of the potions or anything like that, so I'm not going to worry too much about that. They might be helpful, I'm not sure. So I think I now should have all of the the crops, but I don't. I've got 23 of 26. Oh, right, because three of the crops... I reckon it doesn't count the meat. So if you look at it, in my crop collection, I've got three or four pieces of meat... So we've now got apricot, we've got plum, and we've got cherry. We've got peach and strawberry as well, but we don't have apple. We don't have pineapple. I'm going to try and see if I can get a pineapple. So apple and pineapple would be another two. So how many do we need? Sorry, 20. We need three more. So even just apple, pineapple, and one other fruit tree crop would be enough. So I think we'll probably get enough off our fruit trees. Plus, if there's anything else that I spot, uh, we need eight more different fish. That's not too bad. I 
again the craftable items i need to have collected them and made them it's not just collected i need to collect the items you see it says items not not blueprints so that's why we need to make them i need uh six more forageables so we need to be just looking around everywhere to see what i can get um because they might be rare i don't know uh i need one more recipe that's that will come easily from a quest somewhere. And two more friends. So that's really quite simple. Uh, but then I am going to need things like the, the gold star meals and gifting them to the villagers. So I'm going to make need to make 50 gold star meals at some point. Um, but again, like doing all of that stuff, I feel like it's more end game stuff. But I feel like the, the harder thing is doing the quests to get the... Uh, recipes and the blueprints but I feel like I probably now have enough recipes and blueprints to to rock through that so eight more kinds of fish and three more kinds of crop and then just donating loads and loads of stuff okay so let's uh go to the whatever the mining one was I'm sure there was a crafting mining kind of one that wanted me to donate sure there was 10 gold ore that was the foraging pillar there we are donated so i can donate like can i donate it do i have any like gold star anything on me i've got gold star um produce so would that maybe go in here for example gold star crops yeah, so I could donate those. I want to keep my apricot though because I think I've got a quest for it. But I could donate the plum. So you can donate them a little bit at a time as well, which is nice. So when I have, if I get myself a gold star egg at any point from anywhere, if I find one, I buy one off the Baileys, if I, if my uh, chickens and things get good enough, etc, etc. And then I can bring things down a couple at a time to get like my crafted placeables. So that's things like... Um, and I wonder if it's crafted placeables that you have to do for the things that count as crafted placeables. I wonder if that's what you have to do for the crafting um, fair thing. Interesting. So I expect what it wanted from me was probably like a loom or something to make clothing with in the last ones. So I think it probably I needed to make a loom looking back on it. Like this one. I certainly don't have any gold star meals or anything like that. But I've got all of that written down. I just wanted to come and have a little look and donate my, my gold. So I can actually cross that off my list as well. Do you like to keep a list? gold ore i've gotten married and i've completed the quests right let's get back into position in front of my microphone sorry that would probably would have sounded quite far away but it's fine but yeah we're starting to get things completed for this and there's things that i think will be will be quite easy like when uh, it's wanting the gold star crops i will bring a few of those down and get that crossed off next probably um, maybe I can focus on getting some gold star fish. But probably when I'm trying to get the, the 28 fish that I don't already have. Sorry, not the 28, the, the 8 fish I don't already have. Um, I would like to try fishing in the swamp and fishing at night and fishing in the different lakes and things like that. We might get the odd different thing there. If I see something that there, that maybe... One of the fishermen is selling, like maybe Rose or one of the others. Like I wonder if I fish here, for example, will I catch something different? I don't fish here very often. A catfish. So I feel like I'm going to have to do a lot of fishing. 
I don't know why they're not going into my inventory. Do leather. Seaweed. <laughs> It's nice this because I didn't expect that any of the pillars would be getting filled out, but they really are starting to. Oh, nothing else i know that these aren't particularly new things i'm getting here might get the odd new thing maybe i'll start just fishing around the place with an epic lure on once i have a bit of money i'll just buy an epic lure and then we'll just go around everywhere and see if we can get the epic fish i don't have to get every every different type of fish either I haven't tried fishing in the mermaid key. It seems to be catfish, frogs and crayfish at the moment here. So probably after the next catch I'll need to go home I think. Okay and that was seaweed. Of all the rubbish things to have on the last catch. We go lovely something rotted something uh, that's the sound of something rotting in my inventory i realized that <laughs> didn't get a ton of like sand and didn't really get much in the way i got a bit distracted today honestly the main thing is that if the i've got to have a sleep now if the pirates do show up on saturday Token of my appreciation. Blue gold wallpaper. Ooh. Let's have a little look at that then. So at the moment, saving up the apricots for a quest, I think, are we? Pineapple on that one. No, fish, pineapple. Oh, no, we're not saving up the apricots. I decided not to do that quest, clearly. The pineapple would be great. I don't know whether we'll be able to do that within the nine days required. I think I may have to grow a pineapple tree for that. Which is sad times. But never mind. You can't have everything, can you? So herrings are fresh water. Mackerel, sorry. Why did I say herrings? So we'll need to try and fish for those tomorrow as well. Um, I don't know if I've had a herring before, so that might be a new one. Mackerel. I probably have, though. So let's um, pop some of these guys on to dry and then head to bed. I'm sure I had some crayfish around here somewhere. I don't know why I can't find them. I've got loads of frogs. Oh, there they all are. Frogs are better to sell, so if I can just use the crayfish to dry. Then I'll maybe sell my frogs to... Wow, 200 gold coins. I clearly need to speak to all of you about this then. Am I selling my apricot? Yes. Oh, hang on, that is a gold star product. I'm not going to worry about it too much, though. Money is still really needed, so... That's fine. So let's have a chat to uh, Daniel as well, because Daniel has made some money at work too. Wow! Go fam! <laughs> Go family! 2,400 in the bank now, so that's amazing. 
Oh, and the wallpaper we got as well. Let's have a little look at that because that looks like it might be quite nice. Think about that. Did we get the old wallpaper back? No, we don't. Oh, only paper's over. Oh, we're stuck with it then. It's quite cool. Sleep till rested. I will make sure that I go to the uh, mine today. I'll make sure I try and collect sand today. We still have four more pieces of sand to collect, I think. Because we're on six pieces of glass, so we need to get on to eight total. I want this house... I want this house upgraded. And then I'll be having a look at more different wallpapers and things, definitely. Um, I will make more bricks. We've always got tons of clay, so I need to make sure it's processing. If I can make more bricks, I could get another smelter. I think we're okay with the smelters we have right now, though. Let's go and check on quests first. That's what I like to do first thing in the morning. It's a Friday, so in theory, as long as the watering can is filled up, which I think it was. I will go back and check later, though. Everything should be getting crafted for me. If I can get two moral mushrooms, we'll get one recipe for coffee. And no. I should make a cheese press soon, because I'm going to have a, a cow soon, aren't I? I might go up to the Bailey's farm. Uh, I might do a bit of wood collecting as well today, maybe. Go up to the Bailey's farm and just see what... Uh... Oh, you could grab the cherries from up there as well. Grab the cherries from up there, but also... See if there's any nice new... like. Oh yeah, there's like... Today is day five of spring, so it's the day that five cherries are on the tree. Perfect. Ten cherries for me, then. Any of them gold star? Seven of them are gold star. I think that might be worth a trip down to the... down to the pillars, actually. Right, Edward Bailey. Let's see what we got. A couple of tiny chicks. Goose chick and a... Say zero. Is that because they used to have male and female or something? Cow, a pet pig, a sheep, small pig, a big pig. That's a proper big cow. Let's get a proper big cow then. Let's get another chicken in the hopes it might breed and maybe a baby goose they do sell hay up here as well which is useful a milking pail and shears a decorative egg basket in return I'm going to sell some stuff Bring the price down a bit. So I can sell any of my animals back, actually. So I've got one chicken, one goose. AJ Kardashian. And I've got another, another cow, another chicken, another goose. So the coop will be full. I think I might be able to get a goat as well. So maybe we'll wait and see if we can get a goat. Anything else I can sell right now? Not really, but we will still have enough. We'll still have enough money. No wins to you. Mm. 
Yeah, I'm gonna head down to the pillar and like add some gold star crops. Or gold star. I don't know if cherries actually count as a gold star forageable because I'm taking them from a tree. I don't know actually. But I want to keep like adding to these slowly over time if I can. Because the less I've got to do with these pillars, the better, really. So. And I can write down the numbers of things that I've added before I cross them off. Write them down in my little book. But if I've just like shaken a tree and gotten like seven things off it, it's like, well, why not add them? They're either going to be a forageable or a crop. It'll be one of the two. I'm thinking it'll probably count as a crop. Definitely want to work on Limbo. Like, let all those souls free. I'm not sure what the game would... Like, this seems like the main purpose of the game, so I'm not sure what it would involve after finishing all these pillars off, but... There we are. So that's up to 8 of 30. So I can write that by the crop thing so um i will put a tally on i think One, two three four five six seven eight because so i can add to a tally more easily rather than crossing out numbers all the time Animal products, we don't have any gold star at the moment. No gold star fish either. No lobsters. I don't know if there's a better time and place to catch lobsters. After placeables, we just certainly don't have. Forageables? Nope. And then meals, and then nothing, nothing to go over there. Just got to make another friend or two. So eventually we'll be just working on things like the placeables and stuff like that. Um, but again, I've got it all written down. I just thought that, considering I've got like seven things in my inventory that were just all gold star all at once, I may as well pop down here and try and get that done. Um, animal products, I don't know. If I could get gold star wool, that would be great, because that won't rot. I have to see with that one, so... Oh, actually, I could probably just, like, fast travel out of here. So I want to go to the beach, and I want to go to the mines. So let's go over there, so we can go to the beach. But yeah, I'm not so bound by the quests anymore. I'm like, okay, I need to make two more friends. That's fine. I can do that with gifts. So I don't really need the quests for that. I don't really need the quests particularly for money. I've got lots of crops and things like that that I can sell. It doesn't tend... I don't think it tends to give me like gold star meals and things off the back of it. That's my seventh piece of glass done then that's uh my third piece of sand towards that wonderful that's as much as i'm getting today that's fine i might find some more if i speak to the kids um is school still in at the moment what time we at no it's not so that's fine I'll head up to the mines and see how many rocks I can bash. Uh, pickaxe will need a little bit of attention soon, though. I want to see if I do go to the blacksmiths and see uh, a steel pickaxe. I will pick it up at this point. Because I can. And I will be able to make that 1600 back. Uh, but I don't know, the paint. So, it's kind of... I really need this, these ships to turn up. I don't know what's happened to them. Maybe they get shipwrecked like my ship did. Ok. 
get back to my house and then I can maybe like go and name all of my new animals. Head down here, head down here, into the darkness. Now it's really dark. <laughs> Turn the lamp on. I do have like a decent amount of lamp oil now. I've got lamp oil to pass on to the next generation. I hope all my tools pass down. Well, I'll I'll cope. Whatever it whatever happens, I'll cope with it. I'll work it out. We've got two more stone. Slowly getting enough stone together. Oh, I didn't get any stone. I just got like iron ore and gold and stuff. No. Oh, well, gold will be one more craftable to make, though, won't it? Because we don't, we haven't actually smelted gold so far. So that'll be our thirty-sixth out of our fifty-eight craftables. So let's uh, fast travel. We've been to the beach. Yeah, let's go home and then. Uh, I really hope that there'll be, there'll be sailors here tomorrow. Once I got the paint, I'll feel a lot happier. I'll be like, okay, we've got, I've got the th the hard to get thing. I'll let the. The plums and the apricots, like, I'll let them get up to five. Um, I'll just check and see if anything can be harvested yet. It doesn't look like it so far. So maybe tomorrow. Might have a harvest tomorrow. In that case, I might get some gold star crops that I can add into the crop altar. Because if I could get that done, that would be really nice. Oh, I am actually quite liking this house. Yeah. Metal is strong, metal is sturdy, it's trustworthy. I like to keep a log of what I did every day. It helps me stay on track. Love you. Oh, still saying love you. Got something to tell me? It's what I made at work. What, you made money at work? Despite the fact that you're also the farmhand? That's amazing. And you have two bows in your hair, I just realized. <laughs> you can never have too many bows, okay? But you didn't make anything at work. Okay, I see how it is. Okay. Now, do I have anything that I can add to these? I did keep some of the cherries because some of them were not gold, but I did give most of them away, sadly. So let's make some cherry jam and maybe one dried fruit. And then in the morning, I could go, I'm gonna go down to the docks. Um, that's until rested, sleep. She lab is hungry. Luckily, I've got actually quite a lot to eat, so that's fine. I'll eat the silver fish, shall we? Is it somehow still alive? No idea how. It's 4.27 in the morning. Funeral for Jacob Ryle. Go and have a look at the... Oh yeah, everything's growing quite nicely. Let's see. Uh, it doesn't look like anything's quite ready. Um, Penelope should be working today, but I will need to water all of these crops tomorrow. I'll go and check on my animals as well, and then we'll go and check down by the docks and see if there's anybody here today. I also might need to quickly check on the watering cans as well. I'm loving how this place is looking now. I know I can. it's probably going to look a lot better by the end of the year and stuff. Hello! All my new guys are here! Hi! Oh, I'd love it if you went outside so I could actually get in your trough. 
Wow, like loads of eggs. Nice. So probably two days worth from these two. And we've got another goose. So now we've got two chickens and two geese. Um, well, actually, technically, they won't be able to breed, will they? Because there's no space for the baby. Oh, I see the problem. Why we need to upgrade these if we want to breed. Um, I'm not too worried about it, though. But if I do want them to breed, then I'm going to need to... Oh, doesn't it look cute? We've got a big cow and a little cow. Can I milk you? Yes! Milking has happened. So I'll be able to make cheese and all sorts now. So we've got, we're getting milk, we're getting wool. At the moment I will probably just sell it for now, but... We're doing great. A full barn, a full coop now. Very pleased. Okay, so Saturday I think might be a day when sailors show up. So I'm going to go over to the town and see what I can find. Please, please sell me paint today. Someone, someone sell me paint. I'm so desperate for it. I'm like, I want my big house. But it has given me plenty of time to like save up money and everything like that. Hello. <gasps> they're here! I think they're all asleep at the moment, but they're here. Their boat is here. Okay. Wonderful. Their boat is here. So happy. Let's go check the quest board and stuff until they're ready to show their faces. I'll get paint if I can get a pineapple seed off of them. That'd be great too, but I don't know. Um, a loom in return for robin eggs. That is a rare forageable. Why? I'll accept that because of the robin eggs. I think that would be a forageable that's going to be hard to find myself. I should keep looking around the woodlands as well. Here they are. Oh, they let some... Um... Are you friend is just what I needed. I'm Jimmy Church. I wish there was a faster way to get to Honeywood. Maybe if we build a really long bridge. Always a pleasure. That probably wouldn't be a fast way, but... Um, do you have anything to trade? Ahoy! Until next time, friend. Okay. Do you have anything to trade? Oh boy, I've been busy lately. Glad we can take a break in your town. Do hope we'll meet again. Where's your captain? Go in the pub for a minute and see if anyone's in there. They are, so let's, uh, let's do some trading. Sell my bricks, uh, my milk, I can sell my wool, sheep fur is great, the goose eggs sell really well as well. That's 65 just from what I get from the barn and coop each day. It's pretty nice isn't it? And I can start selling my gold ore. I'm sure I'll have more. I'll, I want to make a gold bar at some point. No, actually, I'll keep them. I'll make a gold bar out of them. So hopefully that'll sell for more than 100. I can sell the gold bar once I've made it. Right. Is anyone going to be out here to trade with me? Why is there no one that can trade? The Empire soldiers are up to no good. Oh, a local. A soldier's life is a sailor's life, and a sailor's life ain't easy. But well, my Honeywood friend. Oh, maybe at nine o'clock. They might come out at nine o'clock. Let's wait until nine o'clock and see if anyone pops out. Hey! Here's the boss man, I think. Okay, let's see. 
trade. Okay, my paint. 1500 paint. Apricot seeds, plum seeds. No pineapple seeds this time. And a tincture bark for malaria. Wine of Ipiac. Corrosia Renmedy for cold. And a tonic for the nerves. A columnal tonic. Okay, so let's go get the paint. 17.30 on paint. Ouchie, ouchie, ouch. So, what can I sell? Back to you. Sell wood. Quartz. Because ah, I need to get back up to 1600 here. Uh, I need to keep the paint. Obviously. Okay, lovely. So we're up to 997, so I need to make about 700 more. Maybe when I start getting some crops in, that will help. So yes, I have my paint now. I need to guard that with my life. <laughs> So if I've got paint, and I've got all of the iron, and I've got all of the nails, I need to go see how much stone I have now. I think I'll go back home quickly and just take stock. I can't wait to get this upgraded house. Oh, I'm so happy. It's been nice to get the animals in the meantime. I know it cost me a lot of money. Oh, it's so much fun. It's like a natural treasure hunt. Okay. Take the stuff off, but those are still not ready. Those lettuces. The turnips are still not ready. The peas are still not ready. Once they're ready, I'll be able to sell a lot of stuff. It's going to be really nice. Okay, so uh, let's just do a little bit of uh, patron stuff. So, let's see, patron. We need to name a few of you guys, don't we? So, the existing goose that we have. It's just called Goose right now. But I'm going to call you Phoenix. And this new chicken. Does not have a name yet. You're going to be Warbler. Warbler the chicken. And you're going to be... the Nikki. Sorry, you probably won't have this one for very long, Nikki, but but uh, never mind. At least you've got one. So, let's see. Our new little goose. Be Daniel. I'm not worrying about gender for, like, gender types for names and stuff. Like, I think all of the animals are technically female or something uh, well they did have male and female cows and they've changed them all to just be cows so i think it doesn't matter too much it was uh, getting a bit difficult for people so we've got kardashian and aj and then we bought did we buy one more sheep as well that's aj and this is the new big cow who's going to be Aquatami. Lovely. Did I only buy one new animal recently? Is it just the one cow? Yeah, I think so. So we've got room in the barn for one more animal. And they will produce wool and they will produce milk every day. And we'll get two milk once the cow's grown up. And I'm hoping to make a cheese press soon and get cheese. But 
and to make a loom and start making cloth and string and things like that but that that's probably going to wait until after we've got all the stuff together we need for the house so i still need that one last piece of glass i think i had enough sand to make one more in there I'll go and have a look around for sand, or I'll just buy one piece of glass off Roland. I'm going to have a look through and see if there's anything I can sell. And if not, I'm just going to fish. We have a lot of copper ore. So I may sell that. I need to keep all the wood, but if we did another wood run, we could do that. I could sell any kind of um, quartz we have. And hope that we don't really need that for anything in the future. <laughs> Not needed coal in a while for anything. I still only have 18 rocks. Uh, 26 rocks. So we still need to go into the mines until we've got 14 more stone. Unless I can buy a bit of stone as well. I do have things like bear claws and pearls and things like that as well. I've got extra iron bars too. I've got a hat I could sell. I've got a sunflower pot thing. I could sell sticks. But honestly, for now, I think that's all I really want to sell. Okay. Then we've also got some jams and uh, dried fruits. And because we don't yet have any... Well, actually, I've got, I think, four fruits out here. Yeah, so I could dry those. I know that I'm trying my best to get, like, forageables and things for the... But I think, honestly, when I get my first big crop here, that'll sort everything out. So I think what I'll do is I'll dry all of these. And then I will go out and catch a couple of fish and I'll put those into the preserving vats. It's nice just to have one piece of fruit every day off the preserving stuff. Oh, sorry, off the trees. That's amazing. And we'll have like a couple of apples. We'll have two or three things a day in the summer, then two or three things a day in the fall. Uh, next season, we'll have uh, two cherry trees as well. So we'll have the cherries off those. It's going to be really nice. Okay, so what else do I want to do today? I want to go to the mines. I would love to continue these paths and things. I just don't, don't have time. This game is just constantly has you on the go, doesn't it? <laughs> it's like, I'm like, oh, I, it's going to be ages waiting to get the paint and stuff. It's like that. It was there in two seconds. Really felt like it. So let's uh, head out to the mines because the thing I need the most right now. No, actually, it's better to go from here, isn't it? Um, the thing I need most right now is stone. I'll probably have the sand ready and the glass ready and everything before I have the stone ready. And my pickaxe is getting rather hurty right now. So that's going to need to be replaced. Not always guaranteed to get a lot of stone. I'll check with the blacksmith as well. They sometimes sell stone there. So it might be it'd be weird to be buying stone and buying hay and things that were so easy to get in the early game. But sometimes it does switch around like that, doesn't it? I would love to have this house by the end of the game, end of the, end of the episode. I'm so close. I don't know how long, how many days it takes as well to be, to be built, but it's going to make a huge difference. And that's why I've been gunning for it so hard. ITA then, so we'll... I've got a spare pick, so uh, it's just not as durable as this one. This one I'll need to go in for a repair, I think, straight away. Uh, I didn't get a single piece of stone there. 
Let's hope for more stone in this one. Two. Okay. Need way more than that. Okay, so I'm going to go straight back to the village and see if I can get any from the blacksmiths. Haha, <laughs> Wilbur's pregnant. Either that would eat a really big burrito yesterday. Okay, so. Head. Okay, everyone's heading for. Oh. Or towards or away from something. Goblins at home. I guess I could just go home and see what the blacksmiths, because they both have the same inventory. Oh, was Dan? Did Daniel just go back to work? I think they were all at the funeral, weren't they? That I skipped because I'm a rebel and I never go to anything. No, okay, they won't even go to a funeral. How weird. I'll have to keep looking for pineapple seeds though. Whenever I see the pirate ship in, I'll see if I can find pineapple seeds because I think that's going to be one of the things I'm going to need to get all of the crops and forageables and la la la. Although crop wise now, I think, I think we're only about three away or something, aren't we? All right, where are you? Oh, in the house, okay. I'm trying to get us a better house before you die. That would be really nice. Okay, so I need you to repair my pickaxe. Sadly, that's going to cost money, but never mind. And I would like to trade. Sell you that jam. We need to get another 600 together. Those are steel. Steel watering can. Iron pick. If there was a steel pick there, I would have cried because I don't have enough money for it. <laughs> you have any glass today? You don't have any glass. Okay. It's fine. Um. Working on the farm together is a lot more fun than doing it by yourself. Love you, dear. Okay, so what do I do now? Do I do a bit of fishing? Yeah, let's do a bit of fishing. Fishing is good for money. It's good for drying things. Um, I will smelt another brick, I think. Oh, no, I'll smelt some more iron. That makes sense. I can start selling the iron bars as well. Do some fishing, uh, the fish can be used then on the drying racks, and then crops can be sold. I think a lot of stuff is going to start coming through soon that I can use. Um, actually, we've got some dried fish there, so maybe I'll sell my... No, eat the dried fruit. Dried fruit is the least uh, expensive one. Oh yeah, I don't think Roller was selling stone. I was looking for stone. I need to double check that because I'm like, I don't think... I was like looking at all the iron, I was looking at all the glass, I was looking at all the... All the stuff really. The carpenters as well. They won't be around though at the moment, so... Oh yeah, 13 stone. 15 each though. How much do I need? Let's buy 10 for 150. See how much that adds up to. 38. Let's buy two more. Then I'm just looking around for sand. Let's check. Um... Little dude's inventory. And sometimes little dudes sell sand. Little dude ain't selling sand today. Okay. So 
do I go down to the mermaid beach? Yeah, let's do it. Let's see. I really need that glass to be done. I didn't really check properly the village beach either, did I? We'll go past there on the way home. Sailors are here. Right, Mermaid Beach. I'm I'm hoping for good things here. One piece of sand. Clam. I think the thing we might end up being short on might and actually end up being money. So we'll need to wait till tomorrow and see if there's any new stuff uh, and I will maybe tomorrow we'll have a harvest as well and it's market day and poor Shelab is exhausted now. What I will do if we're, if we're like a couple of hundred short I will just go and get every piece of wood in the game. <laughs> I'll be like every tree will be shaken and there's definitely more we can sell. And then once I've shaken every tree I will go and fish every fish. Do I have anything else that I could put on a drying rack? Not at the moment. So I'm okay to just to go to, to sleep. Poor Shelab is absolutely exhausted, like I said. So all the dried fruit is done. I should go by the Bailey's farm and check on the cherries as well soon. Let's eat the silver star fruit first. And then I need to find a piece of sand somewhere if I can. Maybe on the Mermaid Cove. So that is glass piece number seven. I need to make money. And today is also a Sunday, so it's a day where I need to water my own crops. So let's uh, go grab a watering can. It also, it looks like the crops uh didn't have much water yesterday. Maybe maybe we had just enough, I'm not sure. I'll have to see if any of it's wilted, but that watery can was not full. It looked like it maybe had the tiniest, tiniest bit of water in the bottom, so maybe it was just enough. But I need to check that more regularly and thoroughly. Maybe just having several watering cans in there as well would be helpful. Go in once every week or two and just pop them up. This is my job today, apparently. But these lettuces are ready, though. I'm gonna go. And s oh, are those ready? Um, let me just take the stuff off and see. Oh yeah, we've got a turnip harvest today, and a lettuce harvest, and they're all coming out gold. Getting quite a lot of seeds from them as well. So I have a choice. I can either wait till later for gold star crops. Or I can put them all in now. At the moment though, I need a lot of money. So I'm thinking that maybe it would be better to sell all of this. We'll have a few more crops before the end of spring, a few more harvests. So let's have a look and see how much we got. So we got five, 
15. Oh, so we only got 15, okay. 11, 12, 13, so we've got 15 of each of them. Um, so we've got another 11 plus 9, another 20. So we haven't even got enough. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna go and sell all of these to the farmers and stuff. Um, so I've got 15 cabbage seeds back, which is nice. And I've got 17 turnip seeds back, which is also quite nice. So I'm going to plant them all in, water them all, and then I'll go and sell all of the crops to someone. Because, you know, I'm almost certain that I'll be able to get more gold star crops to add to the altar. I can add them in as and when I get them as well. At the moment, getting this house upgrade is, is massive. It's going to allow us to put so many more drying... Oh, uh, turnips in there. Oh, I think I did cabbages and turnips back to front, but never mind. They're both short crops, so it's not like I have to worry about seeing over them. But yeah, we're going to have this done today. I'm sure of it. I'm sure of it. We just need to go and get money. Oh, but Sundays are such a pain because it's like... I gotta plant everything myself and I gotta water everything myself and it takes so long and then by the time I've done it everybody's like shut their shops. This is what it was like before I had kids. The help on the farm. Yeah, I won't worry too much about checking on the chickens and things today. I love their little... I love the fact they put the herb garden in the chicken shed. I feel like the cows need one too. Maybe they feel jealous, do you think? So after I've done all this, I'll fill this watering can up and I will stick it back in the chest. got loads of water in it i'll just check it chuck it in the chest they, there's a reason we have two watering cans in here that should be fine for for just tomorrow's stuff honestly um right let's go find someone to sell all of this to let's check our mail oh cat hopkins poor cat hopkins So now I have everything except for glass. So I feel like, let's go and check. Um, I need to check beaches. I need to, oh, I need to pay my taxes as well. To get the mackerel as well. There's a lot of things I need to get, but uh, okay, fine. No. Oh. You made five at work today, did you? Nice job. Uh, you lost your dolly. No, I'm not doing that. Sometimes they come back with like gold ore and things, but no, just no. Okay, well, let's go and have a look and see. Hey, Sandra Hutton. Oh, you've got lots of money on you. Perfect. And you've got more cherry seeds and apricot seeds. I think we have apricots, plums and cherries all already planted. Might be nice to have more, but at the moment I would prefer to have the money for everything. So, Oh, wow. That bumped it up, didn't it? 25 times 25 of the quartz. Let's just do it. That that gives me enough money. Um, also enough to buy a piece of glass if a gla piece of glass is for sale. So let's go and see how we're going to get this final piece of glass. Actually, Roland's right here doing farming work for some bizarre reason. But still seems to have the trade capacity. Oh, yes. Okay, I think we've got it now. 
I think I think we have it. So I just need to go and get all the stuff out of my chest. And then my house will be getting upgraded. I don't know how long they'll be working on it for, but I need to move a couple of things though. I hope we don't, but if we do, I would rather I'm just I'm actually gonna pull up the um the furnaces for now, the smelters, just in case we need more room to one side. And then they will go somewhere else. They might go in my little crafting section over here at that point. I'll try and make that look nicer somehow. It would be nicer to have the trees forward here and then the crafting behind them or something, but it's always hard in this game to know what should go behind what. Here, my chest, please. Thank you. I have two pieces of sand as well, but okay, so let's get all the nails, all the glass, the paint I think I already have on me, all of the wood. of the stone. Do I not have enough stone somehow? I thought I did. Oh yeah, I've got two there. That's fine. I think that's everything. So, uh, wood, nails, metal, Yeah, I think that's everything. Let's uh, go find a carpenter. It's maybe one of the last things that, that Shelab does, but I think that's then all of the really, really important infrastructure in, in the game, and then it's just expansion for the expansion's sake at that point. So this is the... This is the good stuff. Oh, no. I'm too late. Okay, I'm going to wander around quickly and see if I can find one of the carpenters. Maybe Jack will be like hanging around the town or... Something, I don't know. Hungry as well. Oh, you're, you're one, aren't you? Penelope Lloyd, there we are. Okay. Um... I heard the funniest story from- wait, wait, let me not talk your ear off. Need something? Yes. I need an upgraded house. Yeah, we can do it. An upgraded interior with a small cellar adds two new rooms. Oh, did it say- hang on. Two days. Two days. I am extremely tempted. Nice, it kind of fits in the same space. Yeah, that'll do perfectly. Get right on that. Yeah. Have a great rest of your day. I'm extremely tempted just to sleep a load until till it's done because I see it by the end of the episode. Although what I will do is make sure that uh, I will make sure that Shelab has like enough food and stuff like that. So, oh, and taxes. We need to do the taxes if nothing else. Okay, let's have a little look where the tax collectors are and have a little bite to eat now. Now I've done what I needed to do. I'm a happy she lab with my upgraded salt box home. I really want to know what it looks like though. I want to know so bad. Where is the mayor right now? Nowhere to be seen. It's gotten a bit late, hasn't it? 
So how long do we have left to hand it in? So we've got 11 hours. 11 hours time will be like six in the morning. Oh dear. Scrodel. No, I don't need to talk to you. Um, I might get a nasty note from the mayor for this one. Rats. Oh no, he's right there. Hey, Benjamin. Oh, I can't pay taxes because I don't have the money. That's why. Watch your taxes. We are done. Okay. Obviously, I had a really expensive purchase going on just as tax came up, but uh, that's okay. That's fine. Phew. No good quests today. So I think it's time for SheLab to uh, maybe do a little bit of fishing and then go to sleep. I sold all the veggies, literally sold all the veggies just so I could get this done, you know? We've got nothing left to dry. Maybe the peas will be ready tomorrow though. I could try that. Let's go sleep. I've got enough food for now. Why is Penelope looking unhappy? Like, why are you unhappy? I'll give you a gift. Okay. Have a look. Thank you for being my friend. Here is some honey soap. Oh, yum. Thank you. Okay, they're not ready even slightly, um, but provided there's water around, that should be fine. Let's just take the plums and apricots and dry those and then maybe pickle a couple of fish. And then go back to sleep. <laughs> I just want to see the house now. I'm like, I'm like not bothered about doing anything else. Even if everyone has quests. Wow, an iron scythe. Thank you. Iron pick still, not a steel pick. We're still going to be waiting for a steel pick. For ages. Okay, dear. Right, so let's dry all of these fruits. I'm going to make them into jam, just in case I don't manage to get a fish. Yeah, let's, let's go to bed again until dawn. Have some noms. I don't think I'll be able to go to bed again now, unless I... I definitely asked them to build it, right? When are they going to come and build? So I need to make a loom. And then I get some robin eggs. And I'd probably sell them, but the reason I want them is because they would count as a forageable. And I need to collect different forageables. Let's have a look. It was a, a loom. So it was probably a loom that I, I needed to make for the crafting festival, actually. Something to make clothing. Wasn't too big, wasn't too small, wasn't too expensive, wasn't too, too inexpensive. 
We used to make clothes. It would have been either a loom or a spinning wheel. What I probably should have done is made both and hoped that they would have chosen the right one. So I need 10 nails and 42 wood. Sorry, no, I don't need 90 wood, two copper and five thread. Wow. <sighs> so to make the thread, I need a spinning wheel or to try and get thread from the tailors. And I'm going to need so much wood. All right, let's try and go to the tailors then. Because it will be important to me later on to going, and also I want to look around the forest as well. No, actually, I'll look around the forest first because it's too early for them to open. Hopefully when I come back, some tart waffles, see they're all like bronze. If I see one for gold star cooking, then I might actually be more tempted. But not for bronze star, thank you. Long. And you would feel so different at night, it's quiet, peaceful, all you can hear is the crickets in the field and the river running by. She's sick or something. Okay. She looks like she's sick, I'm gonna be honest. And while she's here being sick, I don't think anyone is watering my crops. I may need to work on that. Oh, it's not nine o'clock yet. Of course she's not. I wish I knew why her face was like that though, and what I could do about it. She worries me, because she's an adult now, she can get sick. This is why we have Daniel as a backup though. It means that the game will not be lost, necessarily. I think this might be a honey mushroom thing. No, it's a death cap. Should either sell that or let it rot. Generally looking around for any forageable that might be might be new to me, you know. And again, possibly get that death cap off my inventory. Quite ready to die yet. The other thing I should be doing as well for gold star meals is looking around um, the bakers and stuff, the cooks and see if any of those are gold star because I could probably buy my way through that quest if if I can't even if I can't craft my way through it, you know. Could have been the end of Shelab there. That could have been the start of Penelope's reign with her being sick or something. <laughs> Maybe whatever it is, she'll get over it. Right, let's have a look at the quests today. Daniel's still protected though, because he's still a child. Buttered lobster. In return for I don't even know how to make but how to get a lobster, let alone make buttered lobster. So that's fine. Let's see if we can find any thread at the tailors. The tailors, isn't it here? Yes. Close Monday and Sunday. Oh, it'll not be open till tomorrow. Okay, well I can check it tomorrow. So maybe I'll leave that quest till tomorrow then. What other quests do we have? Oh yeah, we're supposed to be make, finding mackerel in fresh water. Maybe I'll go and fish in the lake that's like up by the... 
I never fish there, so I might get new ones. You never know. Ones I haven't had before. Not the stream, but the other place. Over here. I'm guessing I'll sell that honey soap, I don't know. Fingers crossed we'll get mackerel here, I don't know. That one is a roach, we already had those. I think that we will eventually get new fish. Might start needing to use the epic and rare lures, so should do it. Pike. Don't know if that's new, actually. Now we're still on 20, so that's clearly it, one we had before. Perch, I think we've had that before. There are a few different fish coming out of here. Mackerel! I need something like six of them. Trout. Boots. So I'll sell slash... Um, dry the rest of the fish that come out of here. A turtle. I have a feeling that like all the things that I found so far are quite common and that I'm gonna need rare things to finish off the collections and that that's gonna be a little bit more difficult. So I'm, I'm a bit worried about that. It's gonna take a bit of doing, isn't it? The one I'm the most interested in is what's gonna happen when Shelab dies and what's gonna happen with the, the handover and all that stuff. I'm really interested in that. Three. I get one more recipe, then that's recipes done at the pillar. So. Much luck with the hemorrhage, the mackerel. Are we? We've got three so far, and we need six. I'll just keep going until until we've got it, until we've got all six. But like I say, I think that's the last recipe we need, so that's four. Get loads of turtles today. Hilarious. Inventory full. Yes, of course it is. I do not need rot. I do not need algae. It's so easy to fill an inventory when everything has three levels to it. You go fishing and you get five different types of fish, but it takes up like... 15 slots in your inventory.
an interesting one. Is that a, a bream? Okay. Bream might be new. I'm not sure though. Still yet to catch a lobster though. Come on, we need more mackerel. Just a couple more. I don't know why I even take these quests. Can you imagine catching this many fish with the fishing mini game still active though? It'd be a nightmare. I've got a friend look. It's keeping me company. How many is that now? One. Oh, we've got them all. Okay, cool. Throw away that algae. I'll pick up the crayfish. I'll at least dry that and make it into something better. Okay, so now I've got that one done. Uh, I don't think I'm getting the moral mushroom though. That's fine. It's just a recipe and recipes aren't that needed right now. Uh, but that's a blueprint. So that's great. That's for Roland as well. Where are you, matey? At the well. Okay. Hello. There's your quest. Thank you very much. And we got a new scythe as well. Nice. Thank you. Oh, the blueprint's on the floor. No, 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 no. Throw something else away. Uh, shoes. Old shoes. We don't need old shoes. Right then, I think we should go to sleep now. I, I really, really uh, wanted to see this thing done. I don't think I'm gonna have time this episode. Now they're working on it though. He's definitely sick, 100%. Okay, so we've got some gold star fish here. Question is, because I've only got one gold star fish, do I want to try and hand that in or what do I want to do? The rough one. Oh, how long till star down? Two days. So I'll keep that for, I could keep it for two days. Gonna want to be expanding this a lot soon. And then I can get nice decorations and we can have like separate bedrooms and it's going to be amazing. Let's sleep till dawn. Oh, it upgraded! Look at this place! It's huge! It's massive! I can fit so much stuff in here! I've got two cook pots for some reason. It's like our bedroom or something or a different room. I don't know. I don't even know what I want to do with everything. And then we've got an upstairs. Oh, we've got an attic. Okay. And the basement. Great, right, I see. So I only have that much storage in the cellar, I thought it might be more than that, but this is um, storage, say for goldfish. 
that uh, you don't need ice for. Which is very, very, very nice. So I feel like I want to maybe put my bed up in the attic so we've got that upstairs. I'm just going to quickly do this. Do a little bit of rearranging before I... Before I head off. We've got a nice bed upstairs. This is amazing though. And I think there's a, there might be another upgrade after it as well. Absolutely insane. So I'm not going to refill these for now. I'm going to move that stove somewhere else. Well, actually, it might be quite nice there by the stairs. Um, but I need to move everything else out of the way first. I'm so sorry you're feeling rubbish. I got you something recently. Here you go. Aww. Okay. There's nothing I can do though. There's like nothing that you can do for family members that are sick. So sadly, I just have to watch poor Penny suffer. I want to have more storage now as well. I want more storage, chests, everything. I'm thinking. definitely have room for a fifth one there and then room for ones all along the front as well or we could even have like more rows of them Maybe they're a bit hard to walk between aren't they? ice box uh, I'm gonna need to make to sort out some storage a bit more first now I want to see if I can put the smelters back down somewhere but um, yeah I think We've got all this space, amazing amounts of space. Uh, I could move either the ice box or the, the chest over into the corner there. Or I could have an entire room that's just a storage room in there. That looks amazing. Like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I could just fill this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. fill this entirely with drying racks you know that i'll have a think about it next episode though um but yeah yeah look at my awesome upgraded house that is so nice so um that was worth all the effort wasn't it and all the money and the expense and everything it was really really good so i'm gonna spend some time working on this and making more things like drying racks and stuff which will allow me to make more money more quickly She's going to be so nice. Uh, I'll also let Sheilab eat so she's happy before the end of the episode. So I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, then please do leave me a like below. If you'd like to see more, then please subscribe. I'll let you know when the videos are out. Hope to see you next time. In the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome.